My superstar panel return. Dawn Neeson, who are you nominating for tonight's Greatest Britain? I'm going to nominate uh, Ralph Fiennes for defending J.K. Rowling, yes. saying the abuse she gets simply for talking about being a woman is disgusting. Dawn, this was so brilliant, wasn't it? Mm. Because Harry Potter stars have been absolutely terrified into silence, or actually a lot of them, the young woke-topians like Emma Watson, have actually tried to do down absolutely. J.K. Rowling publicly. And so for Rafe to do this, actually, he's taking a real risk. It's a real risk, and he's going to get similar levels of hatred. But as he says, you know, I can understand the viewpoint that might be angry with what she says, but it's not obscene, not uber-right-wing fascist. It's just a woman saying, I'm a woman, and I'm proud of being a woman. Nothing wrong with that. No, do you know what? I saw that today, and I just was delighted. And I thought, actually, there's an actor I like, because, you know, most of them are very woke these mm. days. Uh, Adam Brooks, your nominee. Mine is Honorary Greatest Britain. It's Canadian, uh, the Canadian Premier of Alberta, Danny. Danielle Smith, who says that politicians need to start speaking and listening to the people instead of organisations like the WEF. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If only we had some politicians brave enough to do that here, because then, in fact, what you've got uh, is Keir Starmer meeting Bill Gates today. But there you go. Uh, Ashley James, your nominee. Well, on that note, I feel like I know I'm not going to win, but my, my greatest Britain is Keir Starmer. Oh, not again. Um, because I just, well, I like having PMQs back anyway, because it's nice to see politicians doing their job. But he did make me laugh out loud with his lettuce. Um, OK, sorry, I'm, I'm just looking. Where are Ashley's beer goggles? She's got the Starmer beer goggles on the, again. I think you've got them on for uh, uh, do you know what? I, I'm going to go for Ray Fiennes because uh, Dawn Neeson, what a great choice. Mm. What a brave man. It's so ridiculous that we say that it's brave these days, but the fact that he's a Harry Potter Quiet. star to stand up for J.K. Rowling... Finally. Uh, Union Jackass time now. Jordan Neeson, your nominee, please. Uh, this is the polar opposite. This is uh, the young lady, uh, Jordan Gray, who was on Channel 4, we've already discussed, playing a keyboard with her penis the other night in the name of entertainment. Yeah, and, and remember, Channel 4 broadcast this uh, without any censorship. Total mm. disgrace. It's, it's quite put me off, but I'm mushrooms for life. <laughs> Adam Brooks, your nominee for you. My honorary jackass is Joe Biden for calling our new Prime Minister Rashid Sunuk. Oh, my goodness. Uh, this made me laugh so much yesterday. Can we listen to it again? Today, we've got news. That Rashid, Rashid Sunuk, Rashid, Rashid Sunuk is now the Prime Minister. And then I foresaw his official spokesperson. Uh, pronounce his name the same way earlier today. Mm. And his official spokesperson is a young lady who I don't think is senile, so God knows what's in the water in Washington, D.C. Uh, Ashley James, your nominee. God, it's embarrassing, isn't it? Well, yes. I can pronounce his name properly. <laughs> and uh, my union jackass is actually Rishi, Rishi Sunak because I was You're so... You're sticking to type there, Ashley. No, because I was so I'm excited. glad you haven't gone against any stereotypes Look, tonight. I felt optimistic when he spoke about having integrity, professionalism and accountability. And then he uh, filled his cabinet full of crooks, like Gavin Williamson, who crooks. was sacked from the crooks. government. They will Gavin see you all Williams. for that, Ashley. There are no crooks in Gavin the cabinet. Gavin Williams sacked from government due um, to allegations of leaking Doesn't info from national security. Doesn't make him a, I mean, crook. But Suella look, I, Braverman six oh, days after now. resigning stop now. I'm going with Adam Brooks. Security. And Joe Biden is today's union jackass for that ridiculous performance. That uh, Dawn Neeson, Ashley James, Adam Brooks, thank you so much. Fabulous superstar panel.